Well, here we are at Sunday, and you're welcome to GSFM. It is the 3rd of July. Time is flying. 1901 on this day. Let's have a look back and see what was happening on those days. 1901. Right. The Wild Bunch, led by Butch Cassidy, committed its last American robbery. It happened near Wagner or Wagner in um, Montana. They took $65,000 from a great northern train. In 1924, Clarence Birdseye founded the General Seafood Corporation. In 1940, Bud Abbott and Lou Costello debuted on NBC Radio. 1945, the first civilian passenger car built since February of 1942 was driven off the assembly line at the Ford Motor Company plant in Detroit. Production had been diverted due to World War II. Speaking of World War II, it was on this day in 1954 that food rationing ended in Britain almost nine years after the end of the war. In 1969, Brian Jones, formerly of the Rolling Stones, was found dead in his swimming pool at his home. More sad news on this day in 1971, Jim Morrison of the Doors died in Paris at the tender age of 27. Finally, I remember this well, 1976, 103 passengers were rescued by an Israeli commando unit at the raid on Entebbe Airport in Uganda. The hostages had been taken from an air Air France jetliner. Now, GSFM friends celebrating birthdays today. Can I say happy birthday to Ita Minogue? Hi, Ita. Happy birthday. Have a wonderful day today. Hopefully, all going well for you in your world. And Alan Cochran is celebrating his birthday as well. A new addition to the GSFM friend list. Alan, hello and happy birthday to you. You both celebrate your birthdays today with Jean Claude Duvalier from Haiti. He was born in 1951. Montel Williams, the talk show host, was born in 1956. Laura Branigan, 50. Tom Cruise was born in 1962 and Yardley Smith was born in 1964. She is the voice of Lisa Simpsons in The Simpsons. So happy birthdays, one and all. Uh, Nobody invites me. That is our mystery voice. Nobody getting it as yet. And if we have nobody today, then tomorrow I'll give you a clue. Uh, Nobody invites me. All right, let me know who you think that famous person is please. Our useless fact for today, Sunday, two out of five people end up marrying their first love. Did you know that? Did it happen to you? Go on, tell us all about it. Spill the beans. Tomorrow, which nation owns the most pets? Here's an interesting one now. I was surprised when I saw the answer. We'll tell you tomorrow on Monday's GSFM. In the meantime, enjoy Sunday and thank you for listening today from me, Jer Sweeney. Bye-bye now.